accusations might be this double-edged sword because on one hand, they do something good. Uh, they tend to hold people accountable for their behaviors. But on the other hand, they might be a powerful impression management tool for the people who make them. So what we find is that accusations elevate trust in accusers, they harm trust in targets, and they undermine how well groups work together. I think what's interesting about finding these trust benefits of accusations is that it does highlight the importance of managers being willing to investigate the truth of these accusations after they're made. Because the accusations, whether true or false, tend to harm the targets, and they tend to benefit the accusers so long as we don't have reason to think that the accusers have ulterior motives.